taking y'all on a little drive through downtown Denver. Y'all haven't been here before. Uh, here, let's do this real quick. We've got uh, Mile High Stadium. Well, that's not what it's, the name of it, but that's what I call it. Uh, all right, there. Not that I watch football anymore. I found out it was rigged. Uh, I don't know how long ago, four, three, four years ago. And so I just don't even. Empower Field at Mile High. holographic sky real quick but they're putting on a show today let me tell you I got some real nasty pictures about an hour ago alright so here we're pulling it I hope my camera is focusing hello say hello Mr. Raymundo say hey hey what's up say what's up Bubba say what's up What's up? What's up? What's up? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Alright. That's good. <laughs> this is Colfax Avenue. Any of you guys uh, that are watching my channel watch Patty Mayo? Patty Mayo. He's uh, here in Denver now. He's relocated from his boat <laughs> to, to Denver. I, I kind of enjoy watching Patty Mayo, but I have a slight, um, I've, got, I, I've got this feeling that Patty Mayo very, very well may be born a female. And, uh, you know, it's not out of the question considering how much money he's making. Um, just the position they've let him be in on YouTube. And, um, well, he very well may be upside down. You keep turning me. Uh, and this is really going to shock you guys if you don't know it already. And believe it, all right? believe this one. I was shocked as well, but it's it's literally 99% of people that you, if you know their name, if you know their name, there's a very, very, very good chance that they're not what they are portraying themselves to be. Uh, and the name I'm going to throw out there right now, you guys are going to like this one. And I guarantee you I'm 100% right. Dog the Bounty Hunter was born a woman. Dog the Bounty Hunter's supposed wife, which is really his husband, Beth, with, you know, the fat one with the big titties, that is a dude. Not only that, Dog's two sons that are on his show, the Bounty Hunting ones, they are both female. Stick that one in your pipe and smoke it. And his daughters are boys. Duh. Tell him, Tyrone. Tell him. I've been in this jail. This is the Denver, uh, downtown Denver City Jail. I did 120 days up on the top floor. Here it is. It, was, it wasn't that bad. I was cool with all the cops. I, I had a job in the hallway working with the lieutenant. So... It, it really wasn't that bad. But, uh, so yeah, Dog the Bounty Hunter. And so I know some bondsmen out here 
the, the, the bail bonds uh, companies are real tight and like if you get on their, they have a black book. If you get on their black book, that you will not get bailed out of jail here in, in uh, shit, in the, basically in the entire state. And Dog the Bounty Hunter has a big old, he's got a big old uh, hand and all that. He's, he, he's taken into cash. Now, if you look, if you look up when uh, Dog's uh, husband died and you look up the numbers in Gematria, that's one thing. The other thing is, um, uh, he'll start, they, they have, oh, dog, the bounty hunter's husband died. And, um, so then, uh, they, they put him on, he was on all these morning shows and talk shows, you know, but he, uh, he would say something about how he was so sad that his wife, his husband was dead. And then, in, and then within 20 seconds, go into um, uh, his how he has a new show. Now, what does that tell you? That either a he gave up his husband as a blood sacrifice, or b, which I believe is that fat lop of nastiness, is not dead. And you know, I guess up there. Somewhere up here. Heaven. So yeah, I'm kind of uh, flapping my yap today, but you know what? The truth needs to be told. And that's exactly what I'm doing is telling the truth. That's all I ever do is tell the truth. And uh, so yeah, if you don't like what I'm saying, don't listen. But you might want to listen. You might want to listen to the things I have to say. I don't just say things to say them. I say them because I... If I say I know it, take my word for it, I know it. Uh, yeah, so I'm going to throw this all together with my uh, my, my mask uh, issue at my doctor's office. But we'll, we'll go, we'll, we'll keep cruising for a minute. Colfax, cruising the facts. This is, um, I think it is the longest street in, in the bare minimum the United States. Uh, if not the world of businesses, the longest road with the, the amount of it, I don't know, look it up, Colfax Avenue. Mm, I smell food, Tyrone. What are we going to get, hamburger? Does my bubble want a hamburger or you want something else? You want a bean burrito? <laughs> laughing <laughs> yep so dog the bounty hunter is was born a female all you got to do is look look at him now and tell me he ain't a chick he's got pie <laughs> oh yeah so I, I I I've got a pretty close connection to that person if that's what it is Sons are daughters. He gave birth to them. All right, y'all. Thanks for watching. Um, there's going to be some great videos coming up soon of the sky. It seems like every time I turn my camera on, there's something going on. It's, it's kind of hard to not uh, capture strangeness in the skies. Strangeness in the sky. It's Alex Jones is so funny. His evil laugh. You guys ever heard Alex Jones's evil laugh? It's pretty funny. His elite uh, bankster. Uh, uh, what does he call him? I don't know. He is a funny motherfucker. All right, y'all. Thanks for watching. Bye.